hi YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. We had our first submission to Soul Searching Magazine, our prison circulation or prison publication. Next issue will be called Circle of Souls Magazine. Let's change the name. Our first submission was from Stephen Clark Jr., who is a Burlington native. Now, him and I have known each other since we were five years old, and I guess I could say he's my nemesis. We've fought, we've argued, argued, we've debated, we've been through heaven and hell together. And he wrote me about a 15 page, I'm sorry, forgiveness letter and told me he was saved. Now, I have not read the whole poem yet. I was waiting to read it on tape. Now, when I say 13 pages, these are long copied pages that another inmate copied. The 13 pages were on small paper about this size. Okay, by All My Beautiful People by Steve Clark Jr. Something's burning inside me, feeling yearning to be expelled, a flame flickering in the wind, a wildfire that can't be quelled. While the subject may be sore, it's one of those sores I've got to itch, feel so good, I can't stop, like some fear-ridden bitch. The words and paper we continue to exchange keep bringing bringing me back to the water's edge. The droth strengthening in the days in between, drawn to the pool my soul once pledged. It's been so long, the darkness becomes so dim. It's been so long overdue, it's about time I went for a swim. My heart and soul are coming alive, that pool I'd forgotten, I'd known. The heart of my most re ta recent tangents, it's taken on a life of its own. It's not the last four days of WLUM, not nor hearing Coldplay or AWOL Nation, the scientist in me needs to sail, led back to the pool by new motivation. Well, I sure would not win for poetic reading. <laughs> I think how I'm going to do this is we got through the first part. Now I'm going to break and I'm going to come back after reading the next stanza practicing a bit and then I'll share that with you.